Hello everybody, and uh, I didn't just show you my uh, my weekly food shop, although the uh, chocolate croissants are for me. Um, I haven't had any breakfast yet, and I'm on the road to kill winning Rangers against Ork and Lechtolba, and I believe there is going to be a food bank there today. So I'm going to find out a little bit more about it when I get there, um, but I'll include all the links for the food bank and stuff below, so you can check it out for yourself. But yeah, just got some stuff to chuck in there when I get there a little bit later on to donate, because it's that time of year, it's Christmas, People want to have nice food in the house, and those who can't afford it, it is a real shame. So, yeah, um, got some stuff, going to give it them. Please do check out the links for the food bank in the description box below. But, yeah, today is Kill Winning Rangers against my favourite non-league team, Ork and Lech Tolbert. I do love Kill Winning as well. Um, I love them both. They've both been really good to me when I've made videos there in the past. And to see them facing each other today in an Ayrshire derby, um, two of the top teams in the West of Scotland Premier League as well. So, yeah, it's going to be a massive, massive match today between two hugely well-supported sides in the non-league uh, in Scotland, in Ayrshire, one of the best areas for non-league football in the whole of the UK. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. Let's get down to the ground. Check this out. Look, the pitch side takeaway here at Kill Winning Rangers. I did a video here a few months ago where I, um, I think I did the title, the best stadium food I've in the world or in Scotland or something like that. And genuinely, I have like a haggis bacon and cheese toasty I think it was and it was absolutely unbelievable honestly it was so nice and um, yeah it is open on non-match days as well but yeah here at the stadium now a couple of hours early let's uh, see if we can drop this off oh, happy days yeah thank you very much thank you very much there we go Back on the videos again. Massive thank you for uh, inviting me down again to uh, to Kill Winning. Um, just introduce yourself for the people who may not have seen the first video and let everyone know what you do here at the club. My name is Brian Jardin and I'm a kit man for Corning Rangers. And uh, how's today been going? What's the preparations been like from you for a game like today? Everything's ready. Uh, I've got both sets of uh, football boots ready. Yep. Some will want studs, some will want moldies. All the kits ready for them. They're lucky gloves, they're lucky shin guards. <laughs> boots are all ready. I was just looking forward to a good game. Nice, it's a little bit foggy today, but the uh, game should obviously go ahead. What do you think um, the score will be? Obviously, you won your last game 5 0. Auckland Lake Tolbert lost their last game. They were cup games, so maybe weren't playing their full strength teams, but what are your thoughts on the game? Uh, it's a game we're looking forward to. We also have good games for Auckland Lake. Yep. Um, I'm confident we're getting a lot of players back from injury now, and I'm confident of a positive result for the boss. And so I just had a great chat with Colin Evans, the um, commercial manager or commercial director here at the club. Got myself a coffee here in one of the uh, little suites here that they have, one of the hospitality suites before the game. The pitch is here, the fog is clearing ever so slightly, but yeah, what they've done here is unbelievable. They, I don't think they really spent much money in building this place up. They left an old abandoned ground over the other side of town, which I've visited before for video. I'll include some shots of that on screen right now. And through the help of sponsors and um, fans and stuff, I've come to help out. These buildings that we're in now are porter cabins, believe it or not. And um, yeah, the work that they've done here was through sponsorships and stuff like that. And they've really been able to build up this whole part of the club and even this uh, this stand here. So yeah, they've done some great work here to try and improve the facilities of the club. They do potentially have plans to move in the near future if they can keep growing as a club, but that's a conversation for another day. Big game today, isn't it? Kill winning against Orkin Lake Toll, but you're looking forward to this one? Uh -huh. Yeah. And what do you think the score's going to be? 3-0. 2-1. You look like a, you're a goalkeeper. Yeah. Are you a kill winning fan? Uh, yeah. You are? And um, what do you think the score's going to be today against Talbot? 3-2. That sounds like an exciting game. Enjoy. Um, we've got some of the Kill Winning fans here. How's the season been going for you lads? Catch it good. Been going alright, top four. Yeah. Champions League spot, isn't it? No, I don't. <laughs> um, so what do you think the score's going to be today? It's a big game, isn't it, against Talbot? Um, honestly, I think we can pull a shot win. You reckon? 2-1. 2-1. Yourself? 3-2. I 
I don't like making predictions. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want to get it wrong in yourself. Two, one. Nice, enjoy the game, lads. Hey, thank, thank you very you. much. Uh, so, Dylan, first uh, Talbot fan of the day. I can see there from your jacket and your snood and stuff. How has the season been going? It's been going well, Kim. We're sitting top of the league in that. Yep. Hopefully, we can get in a few points here today and keep that run going. So, currently top of the league, but with a few games in hand as well, right? Aye, we've got cup, cup games in that. We recently got beat for Rob Roy last yep. weekend. So, yeah. cup, but, but you got through the big Scottish Cup against Hamilton <laughs> and you got that'll, hearts in the next game. Oh, that'll, that'll be a good game, didn't it? Yeah. Be it'll, it'll, be, it'll be insane, won't it? Aye, it'll be. And so what see. do you think the score will be today then? Hopefully we can get a, get a clean sheet and yep. get a couple of goals in. So. Nice, we might enjoy. Two yeah, 2-0, nice. Cheers mate, thank you. Welcome to Talbot Park. You are four of your kill winning Rangers fans against Talbot who are top. How do you think the game will go today? Um, I think it'll be a really hard game for us because Talbot is a very well set out team. But, but we've not been doing too good this season. But we've had one moments, but I think it'll be a good a good fixture today. A good game. And so what do you think the score will be? 2-1. And yourself? 3-1 to Talbot. And I've got to give a shout out to Kobe and what was Kobe's uh, dad's name? Tommy. Tommy, right, yeah. shout out to you both. Sorry he couldn't yeah. be here today. They got COVID, right? Yeah, yeah. Right, get well soon. Yeah. <laughs> nice one, enjoy the game, lads. Ben, people might recognise you from the first time I was here. Indeed. How's it been going this season at uh, Kilwinning? Yeah, I mean, we're still sitting what, fourth on the table. Yep. Um, struggled a little bit with injuries. Um, squad, maybe depth, not been quite there. So, struggled a bit, got some results. Um, obviously, this game today, tough, tough game. So, But still up there, so having a good there, season. Fourth. Um, quite well, we lost, I think, two or three games. Yeah. You know, so, pretty happy. There's some uh, Kilwinning fans up there as well. Right, boys. I know, so what do you think the final score will be today then? I'm going to go with a one each draw. One each, like, nice. Oh, happy days. doing well, so yeah. it's a good game. Who's standing next to him? the lines were on the other side. He's a hundred mile away from you. Right then, boys. How's it going? Good. You're a subscriber, right. mate, so thank you very much. Absolute legend. Um, kill winning fans, right? Yeah. How's the season been going? Uh, been pretty good. You're top four, aren't you? Yeah. That's a Champions League spot. <laughs> um, so what do you think the score will be today? One nil buffs. One nil buffs. And I've just missed a goal, I've missed a penalty. Kill winning on 1 0 up. Um, just was chatting to someone in the bar, um, one of the committee guys, and I've missed a goal, but it's 1 0, 2 kill winning. Of course, mate, of course. I've just missed a goal. There we are, lads. What's your name? What are your names? Uh, I'm Riley. Riley. I'm Aaron. Aaron. I'm Joe. Sorry. I'm Ethan. And I've just missed a goal. Are you all kill winning fans? Yeah. It was a penalty, wasn't it? Yeah, uh -huh. Was it? Should it have been a penalty? Was it a foul? Yeah, uh -huh, yeah. You reckon it was? It's 1-0 now. What do you think the final score is going to be then? I think it's going to be 2-1 two, 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 two. That's a lot of goals. It was 0-0 yeah. at half-time. 2-1, 2 Nice one, boys. Enjoy. So, mate, 1-0. Just oh, scored a penalty. Poison. Absolutely buzzing. We've been looking forward to this game for about a week. Big game this, isn't it, oh, against Talbot? Brilliant. Big game. And uh, what do you think the final score will be? Final. I think 2 1. And so if you win today, and if all things go well, where could you see the club going in like maybe five, ten years, you know? SPFL football here? Definitely. League nice. two, league one, I think we could get some more fans here, definitely. A club this size town this year, I don't see why we can't go into the league. We're here with more kill winning Rangers fans. How has the game been going so far? Good. And I missed the penalty, I was in there. Were you here when the penalty was awarded? I only saved it, it was a good save, and then he just tapped it in. Oh, it was a rebound, was it? But was it definitely a penalty? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Handball, was it? Yeah. Handball. Right, and so what's the final score going to be? 1-0, uh, definitely. You reckon it'll last 1-0, 2-1 and 2-0? Yeah. Two two nil. Two nil. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
And so this whole section here, look, is the Tolbert fans. And I would say there's more Tolbert fans here today than Kilwinning. Of course, they are on massive side, but it is getting very fiery in here. And the ref and the linesman especially. Oh, mate, how are you? Yes, legend. Oh, mate, how are you? Tolbert fan? Yeah. No, no, mate. Fucking Rangers fan. Just here for the banter. Oh, fair play. It is good banter, actually, to be fair, isn't it, at these games? Yeah, see. Legend. Oh, no, it won't be long. Um, but yeah, people love these games. Not even necessarily fan of either club, but they are so fiery. They're here for the banter, and it is absolutely mental in here. And the um, the Tolbert fans get a little bit frustrated with the linesman, who is uh, just literally running along this side here. He, you've just seen a few times in some of the most recent clips, but um, yeah, he's getting a lot of abuse, and the players are getting a bit of abuse from the fans as well. But these games are honestly like I've been to Barcelona, Rangers, Liverpool, Man U for this channel, Celtic, some of the biggest teams in the world. But these videos here are my favourites to film. Can't be long left, but it's been constant pressure since um, Kilwinning went 1-0 up from Talbot pretty much. A lot of free kicks, a lot of uh, set pieces, corners. That haven't um, had good deliveries and stuff. The ref is copping so much abuse. These are the games that you've got to come to, honestly. Oh. As you may have just seen, there was a, a bit of aggro after the game, a little bit of fisty cuffs, a bit of a fight going on, but look at this, on the pitch at full time. And look what a strange uh, little misty day it is today. It was actually um, a 1.30 kickoff. They have 1.30 kickoffs at this level in Scotland around this time of year, because it gets so dark at around three o'clock in the afternoon, which is the normal kickoff time. And a lot of the clubs don't have floodlights. Of course, look at that, Kilwinning have got floodlights. Tolbert, big side, they've got floodlights, but a lot of the teams that you see in the lower divisions than this, same kind of level, but like smaller clubs don't have floodlights. But yeah, look here, some of the lads are picking up the, picking up the corner flags now. Good win? Yes, good one. Happy with that? Yeah. This is the football genius. He's the one who said 1-0. Mate, absolute legend, fair play. Cheers. All right, all the best boys, I'll see you at the next one, yeah? Kill winning fans, right? Yeah. As well as Rangers no, and Celtic. Irvin Meadow. He, he just came, he just came with me because he wanted to do trip. So Irvin Meadow are quite big rivals of kill winning, aren't they? What do you like about coming to watch football here? Um, as I said when I was in there, I absolutely love these games. The people that you meet, the characters that are in there, in the bar, like just even the people that I've not shown you today that either didn't want to be on camera or just that I was just chatting to and I don't always want to just put a camera in someone's face. You just meet so many cool people at these like stadiums and these games and these grounds and the non-league. It is absolutely class. Please, to anybody in Scotland or in the area or likes to go ground hopping, come and watch a game here at Kilwin and tell them I sent you as well. And um, yeah, just come and support like this level of football wherever you live in the world because um, cause they love having you here. It's not even about the money. It's just about turning up and just being a part of something. So yeah, absolutely love it. And talk about being a part of something. Remember the food bank. I'll include the link to that 
information all down below um, and stuff like that as well. So yeah, we've donated to the food bank. We've helped, we've come into a football club as well in in the non leagues and stuff. Absolutely love it. Love being a part of something like this. Really is great. And um, yeah, Talbot lost today. They beat Hamilton of the Championship a few weeks ago, and then they lose um, here in the league today in the sixth tier. So that is football for you. Thank you so much for watching. Please do hit that like button to everyone that came on the video. A massive thank you and to Kill Winning for inviting me down. Thanks again as well. So yeah, do subscribe as well. Videos on screen. Click on one to carry on watching. Cheers. And I'll see you in the next one.